Yo, it's me again. This is my third day riding in Moab. I'm about to hop on to Captain Ahab. I was recommended this trail by more than one bike shop. Uh, a lot of people listed as their favorite trail in town. This is the first little downhilly section. Awesome view climbing up beside this cliff here. Yeah, it looks like we're at the highest point on the trail now, so should get fast in a minute. Oh, this nice little tech section off camber corner there. That was fun. Yeah, that was a fun section. Kind of floating over boulders. You're really free to pick your line here. Kind of just a, a general direction that the trail goes in. Nice and fast along this slick rock. Hey yo. Almost lost it there. Awesome looking mountains in the distance there. And more of this pick any line you want type stuff. Gnarly. All right. Yeah, that was a nice little double drop. I don't think it was part of the trail, but that's one of the things I'm definitely enjoying about this trail is that you can make it as hard or as easy as you want. Oh, it's a hot one today. Not in temperature, but the sun is just so strong and there's no wind. Lots of those lizards are out and about. So that was upper Ahab, the first half. I'm on the lower Ahab, and you can uh, you can just do this. It's very easy to skip half the climb and just hop on this bit. Man, those lizards are running across the trail all over the place. Nice riding along the canyon here not nearly as dangerous as Jackson though so far this is just casual oh that is a drop all right that's the first thing on this trail that I had to take a run up to Not the smoothest drop I've ever done. It wasn't very tall, but it had a rocky landing. So I definitely am glad I stopped and looked at it first. Some G outs there. This looks like another one. This looks like an epic opportunity for a nolly. Nolly time. Yeah. Yeah. That nolly drop was pretty dipped. Glad it went well. I am loving suspension these days. Everything just feels so smooth. Nice. That's 
pretty cool. This has reminded me of Hangover in Sedona. Very similar. Oh, I just learned the hard way that you need to scout things before you try them, especially gaps with blind landings. I just got sacked. Still drop and oh good. I'm liking the dirt here. Couple nice drops there where you have to thread the needle on the landing. Awesome trail. I'd definitely do that one again. Not too scary. The parts that are beside a cliff, you have a lot of space before you go off the cliff. Uh, man, I'm bummed on that one stupid decision I did trying to do that gap without looking over the edge. Uh, it could have been a drop on the other side and I ended up sacking myself real hard. Oh, got away with that one. I'll definitely scout a little bit more in the future. Till next time.